Yo, what is up you guys? My name is Benji and welcome back to another video. Before we get started with this one, make sure to please drop a like on the video for some good luck for AMC. Also guys, make sure to join our private exclusive Discord server for real-time stock picks to trade with me and thousands of other investors live. We talk AMC, we trade options, and much, much more. So go to the first link in my description and join our private exclusive Discord server. Next, there's a new article I want to go through why the SEC report is crap. After nearly nine months, the Securities and Exchange Commission released its report on January's meme stock mania yesterday. Their dramatic conclusion, there are many different types of investors and they buy and sell stocks for many different reasons. Good thing we're paying these guys, huh? The report is mostly a bland summary of the run-up in stocks like GameStop, AMC Entertainment, and others. It ends with the areas for potential study, including forces that that may cause a brokerage to restrict trading. I'll give you something to study. How about the internal chat logs at Robinhood, in which the person who made a decision to restrict trading describes selling their AMC shares first? Guys, we saw the chat logs that allegedly show an internal, I think it was a vice president, I could be wrong, but I think allegedly it was a vice president or someone or something. But allegedly it was a high up person at Robinhood that was literally describing, talking about selling their AMC shares before it even happened, the restriction happened, that is. This allegation appears is pending in a lawsuit in the U.S. District Court of Florida. I find it incredible that the SEC never even bothers to mention it or investigate it. This is the usual government hemming and hawing while strong evidence exists of crimes by well-connected fat cats. The only way it's going to change is that the public speaks out more in those remarks. So I totally agree. I'm just as upset about this as anyone else, but I do think there's a bit of a silver lining and hear me out. I do think that the general public, the retail investors, as well as just people in general, are starting to catch on to the, the politicians, other people in power, and what's really going on and, and how they more or less are not here for the people. Honestly, I think the fact that we've all come together and this movement is stronger than ever, this is our only hope. But if you want to stay up to date with everything else that's going on with AMC, because trust me, there's a lot more to go through, Make sure to please subscribe to my channel with notifications turned on so you never miss out on a video. Also, drop a like in this video for some good luck moving forward for AMC. And lastly, go to the second link down below in my description and join my private exclusive Discord server. Thanks as always, guys, and I'll see you in the next one.